the snare is my favorite part. The sound of it intrigues me. What had been the, the goal of Regent Park School of Music? The goal is to offer kids a way in and access to music education, kids that might not otherwise have that opportunity, and kind of leveling the playing field, giving the kids a chance to succeed through music. Follow it. <laughs> Don't let it go and just go. <laughs> The pilot project is basically looking at what is the effect of music education, not on just establishing a musical identity, but what are the psychosocial benefits of making music together. We're looking at how do we understand an awareness of each other, awareness of connectedness to each other. It happens right from the brain, where certain chemicals are released when you make music together, to the point of um, a greater understanding of your own identity and a greater understanding of your own needs and the needs of others. And it, it, it's all done in a non-verbal musical way, which is one of the most profound ways I think you can show your care for others. How long have you been coming here and doing lessons for? Probably it's my third week probably coming here. At first it was challenging, but I guess it's more if I'm confident then I can get it more. Our facility is an open custody, open detention facility. We uh, hold young men who have been charged with an offense under the Youth Criminal Justice Act between the ages of 12 and 17. I always wanted to play drums my whole life, you know? Yeah. But then my music teachers and everything forced me to other instruments. So it was like that thing I always wanted to try but I never got the chance. We've had a lot of young men that we've lost and, excuse me, Even though I think at first they, there might be some hesitation to come here because of whatever stigma is attached to you know, learning something new, learning something that maybe necessarily isn't as cool as they think it, it, it is. Um, once they get here, it's, they just break out of that. And kids from around Toronto definitely need that, need that access. I was at in a, a secure place, so they didn't have a lot of this. Mm -hmm. It was more like, you know, you're locked. And then when I got sentenced or whatever, they gave me the turning point for like reintegration. You know, you're allowed to go outside and getting used to being back in the community, you know. Yeah. Coming here, it just keeps me busy, you know, kind of gets my mind off things. Basically, the youth come in, we have a roundtable discussion as to what kind of music they like. We try to pick up on their uh, preferences and try to play the music that they like. And the key to it is not just listening to music, it's making music together. So see if you can memorize G, D, E minor, and C. G for two. They have gone through so much. They've seen so much. Um, and when I see them pick up a guitar or pick up a ukulele, like these are what society would deem, you know, rough and tough gang members. Every time I come here, I learn something new. I know, the teachers are very, very, very good. What does that feel like for you as the teacher to uh, see these kinds of changes in these students? It's so special. I mean, I, I even, even on the first day when we were, we were uh, just trying to get the, the very basic rock group together, and I, I was on, on air drums on one side and just uh, doing it along with him, and he was doing it on the drum, drum kit beside me. And, and I was like, isn't it amazing that some people would rather play video games? And he's like, oh, I know, this is, I feel so good right now. I want to do this. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Let's take a break. Yeah. You've been doing really Beautiful. well. Beautiful. Once I'll, I'll be able to play the guitar, like an actual song properly, then that's something I'll never forget when I'm on the outside. This just um, reminds them that they're not forgotten. 
I'm absolutely thrilled to be a part of this project. We all know that it's, um, it's vital and very important work. We take it so seriously in terms of the impact that it can make on our, on our, on our city, on our province, right, and the country at large. I can see myself doing it for the rest of my life. It's, it's such an opportunity to be able to impact youth at this particular point in their lives and you can actually make a difference and hopefully, you know, give them ways to focus and redirect their energies uh, that gives them hope. Yeah, it brings people together, 100%. It mends a lot of relationships, for sure. But that's what it is, we live on beats and rhythm. Heart beats the same way, your body moves the same way.